Can you hear me? Thank you. First, uh, let's start with a big round of applause for everybody who made it here in the rain. <laughs> today is called Silo, that's our startup, and Silo is something that uh, concept that you're actually very familiar with because you're here today. Silo is an online community, it's a platform for online communities that lets you do the same thing that you're here today doing in a virtual world, in an application, which is meeting people, creating bonds, doing the shout outs and getting what you need and so on. So I'll actually demo We'll do this. I'll demo the product for about five minutes, and then we can use the Q&A time as well. You can try it yourself and ask questions at the same time if you like. Does that work for you guys? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, um, what is what is Silo about? What, why is it so important to uh, to have such a community? You know, I came to Silicon Valley uh, 15 years ago, and one of the, the first things that I learned when I came to Silicon Valley is how important connections are in Silicon Valley, right? Everybody tells you it's about who you know and you need to know people. And the more people that you know, the better you are. You'll find better jobs and you'll have better access to investors and so on. It's all about connections. And when I asked, you know, how do I actually get to know people, um, then it started being a little bit fuzzier. Do you go to meetups like this one in order to meet people? Do you go on coffee meetings with people? Who do you actually meet? How do you meet people? How do you get connected with people? Now, the effectiveness of these things vary. Okay, we all have our networks, we all have people that we know, but how do we expand? How do we meet new people? How do we connect with new folks? That's a question, right? So, how many of you have been here more than once? Okay, it's a nice group of you, right? How many of those that raised their hands now know, truly know, more than five people? Here. Just two of you. Four. Okay, that's it. Why don't you know more? Look how many people they are. What's the problem with getting to know everybody else in the room? How do you maintain the relationship? How do you build a new relationship? It's such a strong community. If you look around you, there are people who are working for almost every company. They can get you anything. Why don't you know more? This is difficult. Okay? And I run events similar to this, as well as a similar organization, and I've seen it myself. Doing it in person is not always easy. So what we did is we actually create an application that models a little bit of what happens here. Let me introduce you to Silo. Okay? Silo, wait a second, Let's see. There we go. Okay, Silo is a platform that's based on communities and it's very similar to what's happening here today. Okay? So you see all these communities, you can even see as the new deck is a community here on Silo that you can try and join later. But I'll show you one of these communities. Let's take a uh, look for a second at product managers, the product managers community. Now what I'm showing you is not a demo. This is a real life product. It's something that you can just download to your phone or to your computer and try it out. So what do you have here? When you get into the uh, product managers only community, what you will see is the uh, equivalent, do it a little bit slow here. Yeah, I'm off the white phone. There we go, doesn't matter. Okay, so what you'll see is what uh, the people that are in the community, so notice the little, the, these little name tags here that we're carrying, we have the same thing inside, so let's start with those. You can scroll the community and see things like this, and actually get to know people. And once you see somebody, like James over here, who's a member of the product managers community, you can read more about him, but you can also click and see is a full profile. That's actually more than you will get when you just meet somebody randomly here in the room. So you can see who they are. You can see their full LinkedIn profile. But if you want, you can also say welcome publicly. So if somebody new joins, you can say, hey, welcome to the community. Thanks for joining us. Or you can have a direct conversation with them, which is great. If you want to stay more, if you have some business you think you can do with them, or maybe they can offer you a job or something, you can simply uh, just type have a private chat, complete private chat with them. Just like you see here. Okay? Sure. One minute. Okay. The other thing that you see on Silo are basically the equivalents of the shout-outs. Uh, what uh, Eugene mentioned, uh, that if some of you have been here before, you've probably seen this. When people come up here, 
and say what they need. Why do we do that? Because this is truly the power of the network. We call Sabo Sabo unlock the network because it unlocks the power of your network. If I tell you now that I need a connection at Apple, not that I do, but if I said I need some connection at Apple, who here knows somebody at Apple? Let's see if you just by show of the hands. That's quite a few people, right? So just imagine that this power is available to you all the time. When you need something, when you have a question, okay, all you need to do is just say. And with silo, it's just a question of click this little plus button and just ask anything. Okay, you can ask anything you need. You have a question, ask it. And somebody else will be able to help you here. You need a connection, ask it. Okay? So now you want to ask me questions, but well, you can try it yourself. If you want to try it yourself, you can download it from the App Store. If you have an Android or iPhone, simply download Silo, unlock your network, and when you join, look for the S for the SV New Tech Group, just up there. Okay? And then when you join, you'll see the other members, you can ask for whatever you need, you can see what other people are looking for. And that way, when you help somebody, this is probably the biggest thing that Silo does. Every time you help someone, you create a stronger relationship. And Silo lets them remember when you help them. So if you help somebody, then they owe you a favor, and then when you ask something, they will be able to help you. Okay? Any questions? How do you spell Silo? It's Silo. That's an easy one. Any harder questions? <laughs> it looks like it's not the first one that appears when you search. Do you know how many now it is? Uh, I don't know, it depends. Look, look for style on your network. It's the logo that looks like a key. Like a keyhole. Yes, please. I was wondering, so, uh, I mean, obviously, like, what Silo does is, is actually pretty valuable. The, the question that I have is, how do you plan to um, limit requests, or how do you plan to, like, if I'm an influencer or something like that, how do I turn it off to say, you know, I don't want to be bothered right now? Sure. So, so if you're super, well, you know, if you're super... Yes, absolutely. So the question is, let's say I'm a super influencer and I don't want to be bothered, okay? Nobody can approach you on silo without your permission, okay? But if you're a super influencer and actually a lot of people know you, and just think about the power of this community, not just people in this room, but the power of the, just, a, just the entire SV New Tech community, that 17,000 people, just imagine that you say something that you need. Is there any request that you can imagine that won't be answered? Is there any request or any question that somebody with 17,000 people would not be able to help you with? Yeah, I'm curious about what that looks like. Like, if you tag a, a request or something, how? No, people just scan whatever's new and they reply to you like this. So for example, this person, uh, the city is looking for a technical expert, expert on roads. So, you put their uh, request up here, you can see the entire request. They're looking to invest in a Silicon Valley based company that's doing drones. And people can answer publicly, or you could ask, ask um, or you could reply to them privately. Just like this. Okay, and if an answer is valuable, you can upload it. And you can help your friends by uploading your ask. So it's great for asking whatever you need, but it's also great for finding opportunities because when somebody here is looking for an employee, that might be your opportunity. And you see these types of opportunities all the time. People say, we're looking for a marketing manager, we're looking for a developer. And you see these things, and you might want to say, okay, that's great for me, or that's great for a friend, and you can share it with, that, with your friends. Just exactly the same as the shout stops here. Okay. I guess I have a question. Um, how does the company plan to make money? The company is already making money. And the way we make money is we feature uh, something called top talent. We have uh, developers, designers, and product managers that we feature through the network. And when companies hire them, we feature one a week. And when companies hire them, we get paid. We get paid with referral fees, so we're already making money. And it's great because we can keep the rest of the service free for everybody else. Okay. Any more questions? Yes? Is it play 
time for a, a, a webinar? Yes. Yes, there is also a desktop app, just like Slack. You can download it to your desktop and you can use it from your desktop as well. So it's on your mobile. And the idea is very simple. Think about it. And by the way, it's not just the uh, SVNU tech community. Uh, you've got, just look at the number, just look at the list here. How many communities you have? Product managers, designers for Silicon Valley, for Europe, for Asia Pacific. There are thousands and thousands of communities that you can choose and join and meet people in those communities. So the idea is the same thing that you come here for. Meeting people, get connected, learn things, get exposed to opportunities. You can do the same thing on a global scale. Today, Cyber is probably the largest uh, online community of entrepreneurs and startup people anywhere in the world. Yeah. All right. Well, let's give a round of applause to Silas.